my dear students for the benefit of the students of class 7th 8th 9th 10th today i am explaining little bit about triangles let us suppose abc is a triangle the triangle means a closed figure made by three straight lines remember always vertex we have to represent by the capital letters only here side ab i can represent by running letter c because it is opposite to angle c side bc i can represent by the running letter a because it is opposite to angle a side ca i can represent by running b because it is opposite to angle b here side ab or ba both are same side bc and cb both are same and ca and ac both are same we can represent either way now angle a i can represent with the different ways angle a i can write angle b a c or i can write c a b let us suppose this is x similarly for b and c also we can write and i am taking as y and z one another concept is also there that if i will add all three angles of a triangle some will come always 180 degree so a plus b plus c is equals to 180 because i taken a as x b as y c as z so x plus y plus z is 180 degree let us suppose if a is given 40 degree and b is given 60 what will be the value of c so by the simple calculation i can calculate angle c is equals to 180 minus sum of two given angles which is given 40 and 60 so 100 is coming so 180 minus 100 means 80 degree so this is one of the concept of triangle now come to the another part i want to explain the type of the triangles there are two ways one by the angle another by the sides so i am starting with the help of the angles there are three type of the angle i made one is acute angle obtuse angle or right angle what is acute angle acute angle is between 0 to 90 so i made abc acute angle when i joined ac it is becoming triangle abc and because it is made by the acute angle so it is known as acute angled triangle now come to obtuse angle obtuse angle is between 90 to 180 so pqr is a obtuse angle when i join pr it will become pqr triangle so it is an obtuse angle triangle come to this one xyz i took 90 degree right angle when i will join xz it will become right angled triangle now i am taking type of triangles with the help of the sides when i am taking sides there are three type of the triangles i can make one is a scalene triangle isosceles triangle and equilateral triangle what is scalene triangle a scalene triangle is a triangle in which all three sides are not equal they are having the different different lengths so pq is not equal to qr is not equal to rp so it is a scalene triangle isosceles triangle second one iso means two sides will be equal any two here ab and ac are equal so ab and ac are equal and bc is not equal so it is an isosceles triangle third is equilateral triangle all three sides are of equal length here xy is equals to xz is equals to yz so i wrote xy is equals to yz is equals to zx or i can write xy xz and zy so this is an di different type of the triangles with the help of the sides for the benefit of the students i made a table by which you can remember all the type of the triangles acute angle scalene type isosceles type equilateral type similarly right angle triangle is scalene isosceles and equilateral is similarly obtuse also let us start acute angle means which is having less than 90 degree angle and if all the three sides are different it is acute scalene triangle if two sides are equal it is acute isosceles if all three sides are equal then acute equilateral triangle here remember because all sides are equal so all angles will also be the equal 60 60 60 because total is 180 now right scalene right angle is there 
स्केलेन मीन्स ऑल थ्री साइड्स विल बी डिफरेंट राइट आइसोसलीस टू साइड्स आर इक्वल सो राइट आइसोसलीस नाउ कम टू राइट इक्वलिटर विच इज नॉट पॉसिबल बिकॉज वेन आई मेड टू साइड्स थर्ड विल बी ऑलवेज बिगर देन द रेस्ट टू बिकॉज थर्ड साइज इज अपोजिट टू नाइंटी डिग्री विच इज द ग्रेटेस्ट एंगल सो इट इज नॉट पॉसिबल टू ड्रॉ दैट अपोज एंगल सेम कम टू द ऑप्टूज ऑप्टूज स्केल एन वेन ऑप्टूज स्केल इन ट्राइंगल इज देयर ऑल थ्री साइड्स आर नॉट इक्वल बट वन एंगल इज ऑप्टूज मीन्स मोर देन नाइंटी डिग्री हेयर आइसोसली इज मोर देन नाइंटी बट टू साइड्स आर इक्वल सो ऑप्टूज आइसोसली ट्राइंगल सिमिलरली एज अब obtuse equilateral triangle is not possible because the side opposite to bigger angle will be always the biggest one which will be the bigger than the rest two sides so this is not possible now this is all for the basic concept of triangle there is a request from my side i will feel highly honored and obliged if any person will give me valuable suggestions for the improvement of our lesson thanks and regards my mobile number is given below thank you